Hey YouTube, so today I'm going to show you an example of a raw note taker. I'm not going to go over how to use it because there's so many different kinds. The model that I'm going to show you is fairly old, it's about 10 years old, but they're really expensive to replace, so once you get one, you want to use it till it breaks. Um, the normal price is anywhere from $4,000 to $6,000, so they are expensive. Um, as always, check with insurance, check with Vope Rehab if you're getting services through them. You can try your local Lions Club. Um, I know they're expensive. You know, um, I'll get into my next video about some of the pros and cons of them, if they're really worth it. So, they all look different. They're just a, a device. They all come with cases. Uh, now, mine comes with the Braille keyboard, but other ones do come with a QWERTY style keyboard. A lot of them will have a Braille display. Some of them are, might, like this one's 32 cells. They come with different numbers of cells. Uh, a cell is the Braille character. So if someone says 32 cells, it means you can do 32 different characters. You have your main keys on this, you know, as always. Um, your six dots, your space bar, your backspace key, and your line down key. This also has different menu keys, function keys, and a lot of them come with what's called router keys, and that's to get to like a certain cell if you need to get to one. Other ones have different functions, like um, I can switch this one like into daisy mode and, and daisy is a file type that a lot of um, books and things like that come in. Uh, you know it's, uh, you, you usually with most of them can email documents to yourself, you can use USB cords to get it on the computer, If so if you do take a note or do homework or something like that on this. It is easy enough to get to sighted people. Mine, you you know, has an SD card spot holder. They also take memory sticks. You can put MP3s on most of them, so you could listen to music or audio files for lectures. In a way, they're kind of like the Braille version of a laptop computer. And everyone's, uh, you know, everyone's different. Look at definitely look at what you need what they do different ones have different um note taking abilities most of them you can bluetooth to your computer some of them you can use um, with gps navigation again look at the functions look at what they do decide kind of what you need uh, if you have any questions about Braille note takers, please feel free to leave a comment down below. As always, you can also email me at blyndde1 at gmail.com. As always, I recommend the Blind and Visually Impaired Support Network on Facebook. You can throw a question up on there. That's also the best way to find me if you want to find me on Facebook. I'm the one that often is posting links to my videos. My name's Amanda. You know, if you, for some reason, can't find me from posting there, hey, the chick on YouTube who's always recommending this group, whatever, somebody I'm sure can point you in my direction. So, as always, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this has helped somebody, and uh, see you later.